A partnership between Intel and Purdue has the university's baseball team quickly rounding third and headed for home. The Boilermakers are the first team in the country to use a new Intel system designed to teach players literally how to run faster. And right now, this team is posting its best start to a season ever. Fox 59's Mike Sullivan shows us how the technology works. Some days you're going to hit, Coming up. some days you're going to pitch. There you go. One thing speed doesn't do is take a day off. Right Baseball is full of shifts, changes in direction. And as you know, just like in anything in sports, I mean, a split second is a split second. Purdue head coach Greg Goff admits. And I'm old school. You know, I'm old school guy. Yet his Boilermakers are anything but primitive. Last year, I was the slowest on the team, like based on numbers wise. This year, try talking to redshirt sophomore Cam Thompson. I've actually been like the top three to four guys on the team. If you want to know how, you'll have to ask Intel that question. Yes, the tech giant. All my life, I've just been, all I know was just run. I didn't know that there was a certain form. A grad student at Purdue sent an email to Intel asking if they would apply their 3DAT technology to the baseball team. It showed me my form and like how I was running, my peak like velocity. It was originally designed to help TV viewers better understand Olympic track events. Before this technology, I was like kind of hunched over. The system uses high resolution cameras, high speed processors and AI to analyze a player's biomechanics frame by frame kind of helped me see what I needed, to, the adjustments that I needed to make to even get faster. Last year, Curtis Washington Jr. was playing at a junior college. Well, I was third in the nation in stolen bases with 46. And I know if I can do that at this level, it's going to be, it's going to make some noise. There we go! In fact, the Boilermakers want to lead the league in steals. Oh, oh, oh. It's an old school type of baseball on a team playing with next generation speed. In West Lafayette, I'm Mike Sullivan, Fox 59 News. Well, Purdue's first home game is Thursday against Bellarmine. As for the grad student who got Intel to bring their technology to Purdue, well, her name is Brianna Gapicelli. She now has a job at Intel.